to use the Middlenet course catalog uh, tool, uh, first you'll need to log into the portal. So you'll type in your A number and your password and log in. And then you can find Middlenet in two places. Uh, below the My Links section, uh, there's a link to Middlenet, as well as in the Quick Links section, if you click the down, uh, drop down menu, it is the second choice. So either way will get you to Middlenet. So. Then to get to the course catalog, we need to go to Class Schedule. So the watch here, we'll click on that. That'll bring us to the course schedule where we can then uh, see all the classes for a given semester that are available for enrollment. So we go to the drop down menu, choose the appropriate uh, semester, click Submit. Then uh, we can use the um, selections here to narrow down our search. So if I were to just click Class Search right now, I would get all of the courses for the semester that I chose. Where if I come here into the subject um, group, I can scroll through and re go down to specific class. So let's say I'm interested in English Comp 1. So I can click English. And then in the numbers section, I can, if I know the course number, I can type it in. And English Comp 1 is section one is course 101. Um, if I don't know the number, I could try typing in the title. I can also um, here scroll through to see the different um, instructional methods. So if I want an online course, I can select web. If I want a lecture course, I can do that. If I need a learning community, and of course, it's tied to another course with another course. I can go in there, um, but I'm going to leave this as all. When I'm looking for a specific campus, I can choose the campus that I want, and I'm going to use Lowell. And I can actually choose more than one item. If I hit the Control key, I can then click on another section, and it will do both Lowell Day and Lowell Evening. So I can go to all Lowell courses, and I could do this for any area. Um, where there's these menus. Um, if I'm looking for a, a specific teacher, I can scroll through and add that teacher that I want. And if I need a day or time, I can click those. I'm going to just choose Monday. So this will bring up Monday, Wednesday, Friday courses, Monday, Wednesday courses, as well as Monday evening courses. And I'm going to click Class Search. And now it's brought up every course that I section that is available for enrollment. That, that means that there's some so seats left. So if I scroll through, I can see all the courses that are available. Um, and some of these course sections have a note that says I need to take it with English 099. Well, if I'm not looking for that, I'm looking for a course that's just you know regular English comp. Here's one here. Um, it's on Monday, Wednesday, Friday from 12.30 to 1.20 in the Federal Building uh, with Carl Mason. Um, if 1.20, 12.30 fits into my schedule, I can select that. Let me, I know I saw another one at the top here. Uh, this one's at 7.30 in the morning. Well, I'm not a morning person, so um, I wouldn't most likely choose that one. Um, I think So I think I'll take the 12.30 section. Carl Mason, where was it? right here. Now to check to see how many seats are available, I click on the title and it brings up the information and it tells me that there's one seat remaining. So I may not be able to get into this course if I don't act fast. Um, if I have to go to my advisor next week, this, the course may be full by the time I get there, so I may want to make other or choose other sections. If I think I'll be able to do that right away, I would highlight this title so I can bring the information to my advisor and say, okay, these are the courses I'm thinking of. And if I control and paste, I can paste it in a notepad and then print it out for myself. Or I could just print this page myself and, and have it listed here for me. But I might uh, take more than one section depending upon uh, how many courses are available, how many seats are available in the course. And this is how you use um, the Middlenet tool to 
reduce your course sections to see what is available for you to enroll in.